YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Erica. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. And if you are not new, welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited today to do yet another Shein try on haul. This is a complete fall overhaul, okay? Like I'm talking plaid, I'm talking sweaters, I'm talking anything you can think of that is fall related, I have it for you. Leather pants, I got you. Leather blazers, I got you. So sit back, relax, and get ready. This is a lot of stuff. I'm very excited to show it all to you guys. I quickly just want to preface this by saying that Shein did send me these items, and if you want to shop on Shein, you can use my code S2ERICA15 to save 15% off. I'm so grateful to be working with them, and I will leave all of the links and my sizes down below for you guys. So I wasn't joking when I said that I have a lot of stuff. This entire box is full of full things, so I don't even know where to start, but I'm going to dive into it. I guess I'll just start pulling things off the top. Honestly, that works best instead of going through category by category. We're going to start with this beautiful plaid jacket that I am absolutely obsessed with. I've worn this many, many times already since I received this package last week. This I got in a size medium because I wanted it to be just a little bit oversized and it did end up being like the perfect size that I wanted it to be. So I'm really excited about it. I really love this one as well because of the button. And you might be asking me like why, but I have another plaid jacket that has these like metal buttons and they make the most annoying sound. So the fact that these are just regular buttons made me really excited. I will show you guys what this looks like on in the try on section right here. But again, it's just slightly oversized. The tones are really beautiful, like black, gray, white, tan, and like a red color. So very, very fall. The fabric is very comfortable. It's very soft on the outside. Let me see if I can find what fabric this is for you guys. It is 100% polyester, so keep that in mind, but it feels really warm and cozy for fall. I think you can style this a million different ways. I'm really excited to wear it. Next item is another sweater. This one's kind of hard to see, but it is a turtleneck cropped sweater, and it has these beautiful arms that are wide, and then they go really cinched at the bottom. I'm probably like forgetting the name of these I, i'm sure there's a type of style of this type of sleeve but whatever i love it personally i think it's so cute it is a beigey taupe color it is cropped like i said it's not super cropped though so i don't think you'll have any issues even if you have like a larger chest i got this in a size small it's very soft not itchy whatsoever the sleeves are definitely a little long but it doesn't bother me i kind of just like push them up and i wore this yesterday just to go grocery shopping and i paired it with this really cute sport that I have. I have another sport that I'm going to show you guys, but it's just such a staple for fall. I, now that I have brown hair, I've been like trying to figure out what to wear because I am so used to seeing myself blonde and styling myself as a blonde, but I do feel like this goes really well with the dark hair. So yeah, I'm a big fan. 10 out of 10 would recommend this. Size small, and I do believe it comes in other colors. Okay, next up, I'm just going to show you guys the sweater that I have on right now which is this beautiful like reddish brown. It's definitely more red than I thought it was going to be. Oh, sorry, I'm not trying to flash you guys. It's definitely a little bit more red than I thought it was going to be, but it is still like a brownie red, which I really love for the fall time. It is a like quilted pattern. So I'm not sure if you guys can see, but you'll be able to see a little bit better in the try-on portion what the fabric looks like up close. It is a thinner knit than the sweater I just showed you guys. So keep that in mind. It's definitely not as warm and it's obviously cropped. You can tie this little part up or you can let it like hang lower so you can adjust it which i really love you can also wear this off the shoulder which i think is really cute i got this one in a size small i'm not sure if there's other colors but i will link it down below so you guys can check that out and overall i just really like the color with my eyes and with my hair i do love it for fall i'm not exactly sure what to style this with if i'm being honest i do feel like black pants like black leather pants which Spoiler alert, I may have some in this haul for you guys, but I do feel like black leather pants or even like a taupe leather maybe would look really cute with this. So give me your suggestions down below. Obviously jeans would look really cute. And I'm just learning how to style it. I think this would also go really well with that black jacket because it has those brownie red tones in it as well. Overall, I really like this sweater. It's definitely not the most soft fabric I've ever felt, but it's not itchy or uncomfortable at all. I, it's probably polyester if I have to guess as well. And I really like it. Okay, next up for tops is this super cute little sweater here. It's a mock neck tan cream color, and it's one of those sweaters where it looks like it's a tank top and then one of the short sweaters on top, but it's actually all in one piece. So um, keep that in mind if you're going to purchase this. It is not separate. It is one piece. 
I got this in a small. The one thing I will say is it does come down pretty low on the boobs, so I don't really feel like you could wear a bra with this. I'm gonna try it on with my sticky boobs and let you guys know how that is. But the fabric on this is phenomenal. It's extremely, extremely soft, extremely stretchy. It is like pretty opaque. Like I wouldn't say it's super see-through, although I wouldn't wear like a really bright bra with it by any means. It is 28% polyester, 30% nylon, and 42% viscose. So again, very, very stretchy. I do believe this only comes in this one color. I don't love this color on me, if I'm being completely honest. I feel like it would look really good with a tan, and I've lost my tan completely from the summer, so. You know, we're, we're working with it, it's fine. I really love this. It has just a very simple, like, vertical striping with the knit, the way that it's knit, and I think it's cute. It does have like a nice detail with the seams here, which makes it look a little bit more expensive in my opinion. And I'm a really big fan. I gotta figure out how I wanna style this, but I really like it. The quality is there and obviously it's very affordable. All right, so I already alluded to these, but yes, I did pick up a pair of black leather pants. These ones are just a straight leg and I did get the petite version, which not really sure why I did that because I'm five foot six, so I'm definitely not short. I got them in a small petite and I just read through all the reviews on a lot of the leather pants and these ones seem to get the best reviews and I can understand why. They fit really well. Um, I will say they're like a touch snug on me and they're a touch short, so I'll probably only wear them with like booties or heels. Probably not sneakers, but we'll see. And I love that the pockets are just a little high on the bum, so they really emphasize the glutes, which a lot of leather pants just make your bum look really flat, in my opinion. So the fact that these don't do that was a big win in my eyes. They do have loops, so you can throw a belt on with this if you want to. I didn't need to. They actually fit my waist, which is a shock. And then they just have a simple button that is covered in the same like faux leather as well. I'm a big fan. These also did not smell bad when I took them out of the package, which sometimes she and leather can smell a little funky if you've ever had that experience. So keep that in mind. And then lastly, I don't know if you'll be able to see right here, but it does have like a detail stitch right across the knee, which I really like. It just adds a little extra something. It kind of gives it more of like a biker style. So I personally am a big fan. You can get these in multiple colors as well. So keep that in mind. But overall, I really love how these leather pants look on and they're very comfortable. All right, on to the next pair of pants that I got. I picked up a pair of cargo pants which cargo pants are so in right now so i wanted to grab a pair and just see how i liked them on my body i wanted to grab a high-waisted pair so these ones i checked and double checked that they were high-waisted which when i put them on they are very high-waisted so that is already a plus for me i got them in a medium just because of what the reviews were saying and i'm happy that i did they do fit really really well on the waist again they do have the belt loops but i personally wouldn't really wear a belt with these they have pockets on the side and they are real pockets. And then the bottom is an elastic bottom. So I know that there's a lot of cargos out there right now that are more flared at the bottom, which I also love that style, but I do like a little cuff from time to time. The fabric on these, you guys, I just wanna emphasize, these are not like a corduroy or a thick cargo by any means. They are very thin. They aren't see-through, but they are very thin. So keep that in mind. 100% polyester, so that's that. No pockets on the bum, but I do find them to be pretty flattering on the glutes. And overall, they're just a very easy pant to wear on a day-to-day -day basis. Wear them to go run errands, wear them to out to dinner with your friends. Like, they're just style, stylable in many different ways. Colors, I can't remember. Sorry again if these come in different colors. I think it was just this beige color, but she has a lot of different cargo pants on their website. I would just double check fabric wise what you're getting because like I said, these are very thin, which I wasn't expecting. Um, and I'd imagine that there probably are some thicker pant options if that's what you're looking for. All right, lastly for bottoms, I grabbed this skirt, which I'm obsessed with. I have it in many different colors, the same style at least, not this exact model, but just the style of short slash skirt that this is. I have it in black and brown from Shein and I wanted to grab it in plaid for fall because plaid is such a fall staple. So black and white plaid. I can't remember again if these come in different colors. It has a, if I can do it, it has a zipper on the side so you can, you can just understand what that's supposed to be. And then in the front it is just a flap. So it is like a mini skirt look from the front but in the back it's just shorts. 
So I absolutely love these. They fit me like a glove. I got a size small, which is a US 4. And for fabric, these are 3% elastane and 97% polyester. So they're not super stretchy by any means, um, but they do have a little bit of give. So if you're looking for a very stretchy pair, I wouldn't necessarily recommend these. Or if you're nervous that they're gonna be too small, I would just size up. But again, I had no issues with the sizing on these. I'm a size small um, in most Shein items. So I just grabbed my regular sizing based off of the other reviews and I was good to go. All right, next up is a leather blazer, which I definitely need to iron because it's quite crinkly when I took it out of the box, but I love it nonetheless. Um, I wanted an oversized leather, leather, if you will, blazer for the fall time. And so I grabbed this in a medium and I'm really happy that I did because it fits just oversized enough. It does have a button in the front, which I was looking for. I wanted one that I could actually do up if I wanted to. And then it does have real pockets in the front. So that's a huge bonus. Smell, didn't smell anything weird. So again, I don't know, maybe Shein's getting better with their leather, the smells, but this one didn't have any weird smells. The inside is not leather. It's just like lined with like a faux silk kind of. So it's very comfortable in the inside. No shoulder pads or anything like that. I'm not a huge fan of shoulder pads. And then like any blazer, it has like the collar and the little whatever this part is called on the side. So again, I will show you guys what this looks like on in the try on. I don't believe this comes in any other colors, but I will say Shein obviously has a ton of other pleather blazer options in multiple different colors. So if you're looking for like a taupe or a brown or a white, they have a ton of options for you guys for this fall season. So definitely check out their website. All right, lastly, I wanted to pick up a new bag or a new accessory. So I found this one and I just thought it was very professional, very like expensive looking and it is very sturdy when it came in the mail. So I was really excited about that. It has a little tiny um, handle, but it also comes with a removable strap. So if you want to make it long and like a crossbody, that's also an option for you. So when you open it up, it has a middle section that is just a zipper and then two other side components here. So there's lots of room in it. And I think there's also, oh yeah, there's also a little front pouch too. So lots of room in this bag for you guys. The handle is very sturdy. I just think it looks expensive and just like really professional. So I'm excited to style this. Obviously black and gold pretty much goes with everything. I wear a lot of gold accessories and I wear a lot of black. So that's why I grabbed this bag. Really excited to style it. All right, you guys, that is gonna conclude my second fall try on. If you haven't seen my first fall try on haul, definitely go back and watch it. It's on my channel. So don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss more videos like this. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget that you can use my code S2ERICA15 if you want to order something from Shein. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and always for the support. I really appreciate it. Comment down below if you have any other video suggestions and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.